I'll be doing an unboxing and review today of the 164 scale Dodge pickup with trailer and bells. I just picked this up at Mills Fleet Farm along with some red paint for my model barn and some ammo for my 20 gauge. So I'm going to open this and do a review on it. We're going to be using this big knife because I lost my smaller pocket knife. Always cut away from you. box comes with a collector's card here's a look at it uh, the bales are the cheap bales don't look realistic at all plastic squishy pretty small they do stay on if you roll the car kind of so it's it, if it's good for a display but if you're looking at playing with it, with the bales on, that might be a little hard. Bales are about this big, this big compared to the truck. And the total amount of bales is 11 hay bales. Look at the trailer, it's a silver, shiny silver color. Uh, this is all die cast metal, it's a uh, wooden bed, metal prop. Um, this does not fold up, stays down. But this can come up to tilt, lean. Uh, nice gooseneck trailer. So we'll look at the truck. It's a red, it's a red Ram 2500 Super Duty. All die cast metal. Here's a look at the front. Really nice car. There's a look at the back. Got a hitch for gooseneck trailers at the bottom. About this big compared to my hand. I have seen the same car with the hood open, but I can't seem to get the hood open on this one, so I'm not really sure how that works. It doesn't take very long to set all the bales up, probably around maybe 30 seconds. It does get a little frustrating because when you put the ones on top, it kind of puts pressure on the ones down below and they tend to roll. And that's it for the review and unboxing of the 164 scale. Dodge pickup with trailer and bales. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you down on the model farm.